Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a requested video of how to cover up dark circles or bags under your eyes. Now it's something that I kind of battle with. I have pretty um, terrible dark circles under my eyes pretty much every day. So I'm here to help. So before I show you the demo and show you how I cover my dark circles, which you've probably seen already in a tutorial, I'm just pointing everything out to you specifically. Um, let's talk about different colors and how they work and all that stuff. So, I used to cover my under eye area. It's the L'Oreal True, this looks terrible. The L'Oreal True Match um, Super Blendable Concealer in Fair Light or C123. Um, this is a more on the thin side product, but it's not too sheer, so it has good coverage. Now, I have my dark circles tend to have more of like a gray, almost black tone, so I use a more neutral color to cover them. However, if you find that you have a more green or purple blue tone to your under eye circles, you may want to use something that's more salmon colored or peachy. So I have, this is my Makeup Forever Concealer Palette. It comes with a um, array of colors, including a green concealer to correct redness. Um, so if you have, depending on your skin tone, you can choose um, which color will benefit you. And these have more of a peachy undertone to them, depending on whether you're fair or more of a warm, dark skin tone. Again, just to reiterate, if you have more of like a gray black tone to your under eye circles like I do, you want to use something a little more on the neutral side. Um, and if you have more like a purple, um, you can use like a yellow or peachy concealer. And if they're blue tones to your under eye circles, you want to use something more salmon pink colored. Now as far as blending them out, you can use your fingers or I, in this demo, will be using my beauty blender. And also I will be using a beauty blender to apply the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. Um, it is very important that if you use a cream product, you want to set it with a powder right over it so that it stays. Otherwise, in an hour, you'll be showing your dark circles again. So let's get right to the demo. I'm going to take my L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Concealer in Fair Light. I'm just going to apply the concealer in a triangle shape. We're going to go from the corner of your eye, inner eye. You're going to go from the inner corner of your eye down straight the side of your nose. Like that. And then line up with the outside corner of your eye. And then with a beauty blender or your finger, you're just going to blend that in. And what this triangle shape does is actually lift up your eye. It looks like you got an eye lift. You can see that this eye looks brighter and more lifted than this eye. I'm just going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. Take any setting powder. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte powder in translucent, transparent. Just want to set that. And I use the uh, wide end of the beauty blender and I just kind of press the powder into the area that you concealed. This way, concealer doesn't move around on you. And looks flawless. So I hope you like this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you do. Don't 
don't forget to subscribe to see more videos from me every Tuesday and Friday. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter, on Instagram, on Tumblr, on Pinterest. I'll put all the links down below. I hope you're all having a great week, and we'll see you all in the next video. I love you. Bye.